Hello and welcome everybody. In this section we're going to be learning about creating grading styles in Civil 3D. Let's get started. In this exercise you'll create a new grading style and slope pattern. This exercise continues from creating grading criteria. Now note that this exercise uses the grading-1 drawing with the modifications you made from the previous exercise. So let's start by going to the tool space and then click on your settings tab. Expand your grading collection and then expand your grading styles. Select your grading styles collection, right click and select new. Now we're in the grading style dialog box. Make sure you're on the information tab and then type in the following name. We're just going to call this ditch and optionally you can add a description. Next, click on the display tab. We're going to change the color of the daylight line. We do that by clicking this box right here and we're going to change it to red. Click OK. Now click on the slope patterns tab. Under Options, go ahead and check the box for Slope Pattern. Now it's currently on Basic. What we're going to do is we're going to click this drop down and we're going to select Copy Current Selection. We're going to change the name to Ditch Slope. And then go ahead and click the Layout tab. In the Component field, select component 2. Now let's scroll down until we get to this section right here, slope line symbol. We're going to change the symbol type to none. Now let's go ahead and click OK. Now as you can see the new ditch slope pattern is selected for the ditch grading style. We can learn more about our grading style if we click on Summary and expand this information. As you can see, under the Slope Pattern Style, we have it set to Ditch Slope, which we just created. Next, go ahead and click OK. Now if we go into our Tool Space under the Settings tab, we can expand our general settings, expand multi-purpose styles, and then select slope pattern styles. And the style that we just created for our ditch shows up right in this section here. So that's how you go about creating grading styles in Civil 3D. If you'd like to learn more about Civil 3D workflow tips and tricks, visit AutoCADCivil3DTraining.com and be sure to sign up for future video notifications or click subscribe on our YouTube channel. Again, my name is Charles Ellison. Take care.